Ready for a ghost story? All right. What about this guy? Well, anyway. This story is taking place in Excalibur Dance Club. No longer a dance club. 632 North Dearborn Street, River North. The former Chicago Historical Society building, better known as Excalibur to most party-friendly Chicagoans, has long had the reputation for being one of the most haunted buildings in the city of Chicago. For decades, employees claimed to have witnessed a wide variety of supernatural activity. Wine taps in the cellar being turned on by themselves. Bottles suddenly breaking in the middle of the night. And even apparitions of a man in a tuxedo, a woman in red with a little girl. Visitors have reported hearing Children cry, describe a feeling of heavy energy, and have difficulty breathing when in the dome room, the building's paranormal hotspot. There have been plenty of rumors surrounding the source of paranormal activity, but the most common one being that the building was used as a temporary morgue after the Eastland disaster in the Chicago River over 100 years ago. Story on that at another time. Most are either false or difficult to prove simply because they predate the Chicago fire which, you know, burned down the original building and allegedly everyone who took shelter inside the fireproof building who now supposedly haunt the place. Boxes of alcohol will stack themselves 15 feet high in the cellar. People have reported being watched while in one of the main washrooms by ghosts, not creeper employees of the dance club. Disembodied voices are heard in the cellar and the stocking areas of the club. If you've been to this dance club comment below give us your story on the ghost sightings you've seen please subscribe for more ghost stories i hope you enjoyed them until next time why so serious <laughs>